Hey Taurus, this is Zahara Stars with Illum Astrology doing your October 2019 tarot reading. Please keep in mind these are general readings. They will not resonate with all of you. Um, and the timing is different, so they're actually kind of timeless. All general tarot readings are. If the story resonates with you and your current situation, then it's likely for you. If not, then check your rising sign or your moon sign for your messages may be there instead. All right, so let's get started with Taurus. What's to come for October 2019 for Taurus, Sun, Moon, or Rising? What messages do we have for Taurus, Sun, Moon, or Rising? All right, right out of the deck, we have a hope and a wish being fulfilled. This is the Nine of Water, total happiness overseeing your reading. How fabulous is that? Wow, and we got the Page of Water, which is a love offer coming through. Could be a Pisces, Scorpio, or Cancer, but we do have a love offer coming through right in the center. And it's something that definitely is from your past. Could be a, a deep-rooted family member, I mean, a deep-rooted past history with somebody, a close friend, a family member, um, or a lover from the past that wants to come through and give you an offer of love and it's something you've been hoping and wishing for with everything you got. Yep, and it's been stuck in the past position. We have the hangman. So something wasn't moving forward with this person, okay? We're not getting an exact sign, but except for the page of water, which could be, like I said, Scorpio, Cancer, or Pisces. But it's definitely somebody that you have a history with or a soulmate connection or a past life connection or somebody from the past and the nine of water indicates it's a hope and a wish being fulfilled we got the hermit card which is a realization okay some of you maybe what i'm feeling is you guys have been stuck about the situation or you've been really wondering what's going on reviewing under like trying to understand what's happening with the situation with this person who's coming through with an offer and it's a hope and a wish being fulfilled and it's somebody from the past but the hermit card is also about illuminations, realizations, higher learning. You know, it's like you guys took a time out. You've been heavily in thought about this. Let me get some clarity on this. Can you tell me more about the hermit card for Taurus? Some of you could be also, just on a different note, going and learning something new. You've definitely been holding on to this person or they've been holding on to you. You've been waiting. I feel like you've been waiting for this person. Can you tell me about this page of water? What is this offer coming through for Taurus? Sun, moon, or rising? All right, we got the, hold on. We got the six of air in reverse, but it was going to pull out another card. Hang on. Taurus, what is this page of water? It looks like somebody that left you or you left them that wants to come back. Definitely. Yeah, and you guys want to have a future together. This is definitely somebody that left or you left them from the past, okay? And they want to come back now, I see. And it's something you've been hoping and wishing for. Now, this could be vice versa. You want to go back to somebody from the past as well is what I'm seeing here. Um, and... you are looking you're thinking about the future with this person or they're thinking about the future with you and you've definitely spent some time and thought in thinking about this okay tell me about this three of fire and the page of water for taurus all right Yeah, there's a new start coming through here. Passion. There's a lot of passion here. Could be a um, Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries for some of you that you've been really hoping, okay? This person made you feel really good or you make them feel really good. You've been really hoping for this to happen. It's been stuck, okay? They, they may have left you or you left them. They're from the past, but they're coming back or you're going back to them because it's a three of fire and the messenger of fire is like now seeing what it is you want or them seeing what they want and making the action to come towards you and tell you how they feel or to start something new.
What is this for of Earth and the Hermit? You've been hold, holding on to them. They, they've they been holding on to you. They, I feel like they really loved you a lot. They love you a lot. They, they definitely want you to make the offer or vice versa. You really want them to make the offer. And it's coming through the Eight of Fire here. There's a breakthrough communication coming through. Travel maybe for some of you. But I see a lot of communication coming through because they don't, they haven't let go of you. And they've been thinking a lot about you. And remember, the roles can be reversed, Taurus. This could be you thinking a lot, holding on to somebody and wanting to take the action towards them as well. But I feel like regardless, this is something you've been really hoping for and it's coming up in your reading. Somebody from the past that you left or they left wants to come back through. The feelings are mutual here. You want them and they want you. So take the action or you can expect the action to be coming towards you. Wow, awesome, Taurus. Let's see what kind of messages we have for Taurus. For my Oracle deck. What messages do we have for Taurus? Me an Oracle for Taurus. We got intention. Somebody has the intention, okay, of coming back to you for sure. Or you have the intention of wanting to reach out to somebody else because these are general readings. The energies can go both ways. But regardless, I feel like you both have, you both want each other back. Okay, so set your intention and make and take the action or realize that if you've had the intention to get back together with this person, it, I, I, they have the same intention. <laughs> they have the same intention. Okay, and then we got perception. Interesting, it is all in the perception. I mean, maybe some of you are thinking, I don't know if this person wants me back. But they do. <laughs> or vice versa. They're thinking, I don't know if, if, if Taurus wants me back. But you do want them back. Is what I'm seeing here in this particular reading. Um, and maybe there was some misunderstandings in perception of how you see things or how they see things. That's going to get cleared up. Because there's definitely activity coming through here. And you both have been holding on to each other. But not making action. And making the peace. Wow. Yep, I definitely see a reconnection for those of you that it applies. Those of you that have been holding on to someone, they've been holding on to you too. They want to make an offer to you. They want to come through. It's, things have been stuck. There's been issues with perception or, you know, maybe making the peace. But this could be a friend, a family member. It could be a water sign, a um, Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, a fire sign. Uh, Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries. Um, but again, there's also the Virgo card. You know, it just... These are general readings, so if the sign is not here, it doesn't mean it's not your person. It's just what I'm seeing here. Let me see if I can get some clarity on this for you guys, just because there's not specific, you know, a whole lot of specific signs here. What is this regarding, or who is this person coming back, or... For Taurus. Yeah, we got Mercury communication coming through. Absolutely. Um, for some of you, if this person was a bit mysterious, difficult to figure out, the numinous, okay? Um, mysterious, this is likely the person as well. We also got Libra. For some of you, it may be an Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini. I did see Libra. Um, coming through also, but also a fire sign. Okay. Could be a Leo as well. The sun, this is all healing. This is positive. The sun card, Mercury, communication coming through positively. Positive movement forward and healing. And then we also got the Aquarius card. For some of you, it could be an Aquarius. We got Libra, Aquarius, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries.
somebody you felt very comfortable with, maybe lived with, maybe just feel like family together with to help kind of figure out who this person is. So this is going to be, they could have an Aquarius, Sun, Moon, or Rising, Libra, Sun, Moon, or Rising, uh, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries. This is a person from the past that you definitely broke up, separated from, or they did from you, okay? And they're coming through and they want to express their feelings and love for you or, and, or you want to do this with them. You guys were very happy. There's been, you've been feeling a little stuck about the situation, but you guys have been holding on to each other and I feel it's completely mutual in this particular reading. So thank you so much for joining me. I'm sending you guys positive energy for all the best. If you'd like your own personal reading regarding your situation, you can visit my site at www.alumastrology.com. I'm going to be doing um, in-depth love readings also following these. So if you haven't subscribed, please do. I use a different set of cards to do those. Those are general readings as well. So they may or may not resonate with your particular situation, but sometimes I catch you and it's right on when I do. Um, so do subscribe if you haven't. I'm sending you guys positive energy, your own personal reading. Sorry. Again, www.alumastrology.com. All right, Taurus. I love you guys. All the best to you. Until next time.